All right, so this is the final video on fine-tuning the uh, tramming of the PNC in IO sender. And what I've got right now is I've got it zeroed out uh, to zero all the way around. You can hear it's rubbing on there. And how I did this, I got it perfectly. Perfectly at zero. It took me like six hours because it's my first time. But how it works is you first do the Z like I explained in the first video. And you do the macro adjustments with these bolts up here. And then you raise it, and then there's four more at the bottom where you do the macro adjustments of the plate this way. Um, and then once you get that, then you do the fine tuning by loosening these four, and you adjust these to get the uh, nod fine tuning, and you adjust these to get the rotation fine-tuning. For the plate fine-tuning, the uh, bolts are here. So how I did it was I did the macro adjustment on the plate. I did the Z first, then I did the macro adjustment on these bolts using this. And then I went and did the fine-tuning adjustment, but I couldn't get it perfect. And I think it's because these bolts wear into the um, aluminum. And then when you go to reseat it, it, it turns based on the wear pattern. And I guess if I put washers behind these, it, w it would be okay. That's probably the best thing to do is to put washers behind these so you can fine tune and it won't skew back into place based on these uh, sinking down in. But anyway, I could only get it tweaked so much um, this way. So then I went back, I tightened, them, I tightened these up and then I went back to the macro and did one final adjustment this way using this and then it was perfect so now i'm right at zero all the way around all right so that's how you do the tramming in uh, io sender using uh, uh, for a pnc and just remember that you use your page up and page down buttons and you change your distance in millimeters here using control and then zero, one, two, or three. So control zero is there, control one goes to 0 0.1, control two goes to one millimeter and control three goes to 10 millimeter distance at a time. And so if I press page up now, there go 10 millimeters. Page down, goes 10 millimeters. Anyway, um, now that I've got this uh, trammed perfectly, at least for this, then I'll probably surface and I'll add in my T-track and then another layer of MDFs slats on the top going front to back for the y-axis but anyway hope that helped you uh figure out how to do the tramming on a print nc in io sender thanks